The name's Fletcher. Frank Fletcher. Private Eye. Eh, I used to be a private eye. Up until uh, strenuous circumstances forced me out of my home in Liberty City. Now I'm starting a new life in Los Santos, and well, things have been different. I started working as a courier for the local post office. It wasn't hard to get a job there. One of the qualifying questions were, are you prone to having blackouts? To which I'm pretty sure the HR worker promptly blacked out shortly after asking said question. So there I was, in the city of Los Santos, starting anew. And boy, did it get old fast. Oh, don't get me wrong, there's plenty of things to do in this city and lots of people to talk to. But you can only spice up package delivery so many times before you start going cross-eyed and stir-crazy. It was obvious I needed a day off. So I decided to hang out at the bank. It's apparently a hangout spot of sorts. That's where I met two would-be friends named Caleb and Rivaldi. We hung out and chewed the fat while various other characters around us just ran around and made us question the city's sanity as a whole. After a while, an interesting fellow named James Sinclair showed up to advertise his services. Apparently, he sold crates and rented trucks for mining. Well, that's, of course, when the uh, mining incident happened. Hey, Frank, uh, what do you say we go uh, for a ride? Me, you, and um, Speed. Oh, yeah, Today sure, why gone. not? It's like my one day off. Or we're in any place you guys want to go? Okay, okay yeah, maybe yeah. probably. Uh, weird, but... Show us around, man. Uh, maybe take us to this uh, mine they're talking about if you know where it is. <laughs> I don't. It'll be an adventure, though. Hell yeah, I'm always down for adventures. Oh, actually, Ready hey, uh, Mr. Sinclair? Yeah. Uh, it, would, <laughs> would it be alright to drop by the mine just to visit it, or is it just a strictly if you work there only? Oh, you can drop by. Okay, just make it sure, because we might drop by there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, if you look on look on the GPS, uh, they're pretty good at the GPS here. There's an icon on there, it's like a purple claw. Have a look on that, that's the mines. And then if you look at your GPS again, there's the uh, southeast of the map. You see like three white little blocks. That's the foundry where you sell your mines. Yeah. And if you take a crate, You'll be making 3,005 on copper. That's it. Do the ledge is making close to 5 of okay, <laughs> Alright. Cool. Wow. Alright. That's without a truck. If you get a truck off me, shit. You're going to be a millionaire by tomorrow. <laughs> right, because you can shove more stuff in that said truck. Yep. Yeah. If you do ledge, it's 16k a run. If you do copper, you're on 10k a run. Oh, you hear that, Caleb? Just get by from my friend. He's a good guy. <laughs> Honest man. And obviously you got you'll have my number if you run into any trouble. I come. Skitty pack. But they don't give you your number in public. I give you your I give you my number, yeah. My name's James. Yeah. Yes, I know your name, but they don't give you your number. Yeah, just grab it off Caleb man, he's got it. I'll give you the number, man. Actually, hang on I one to, second. I need to. I, I, I need to sleep uh, one second, okay? <laughs> Can you right. stop right here? I need to sleep. You, you, you Wait to about sleep. few minutes. Few minutes, okay? Uh, I need to sleep, okay? It, okay. You want me to wait until yeah. you're finished sleeping? Yes. Wait a second, okay? Oh, I'll be okay. a fast. I like be a speed, you know. Okay. Uh, go ahead and take a speed nap. Oh. No, sorry, I'll just up past that for just a sec. <laughs> you're both, you're both passed out a bit. Uh, so Rivaldi is taking a, a quick power nap. Uh, that may or may not involve his existence with reality. And he said he'll. Oh uh, shit! He'll. He said he he said he shall return. So I assume that means he's going to be waking up any minute now. And, uh, where are you going? Speed! What? Speed! <laughs> I don't think he jumped out, did he? Speed! What, did, did we actually lose him? And you're telling me he just disappeared out of the back of the car? Well, I mean, I just, I assume that's, you know, 
the thing that happened. It, it may not be. He might have jumped oh, out while we were driving. I'm not sure. Just be a thing to do, man. I'm worried about him now. Well, I mean, it, it, he's he, he strikes me as a durable fellow. If he did jump out of the vehicle while it was moving, I'm fairly sure he's all right. A little bit. And besides, at least he didn't do it when we were deep in the boonies, because that would have been trouble. This is true. This is true. Okay, well, um, what do we do? We, 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 we wait for him. <laughs> well, we'll see if he catches up with us for a minute here, and if uh, he don't, well, I mean, progress waits for no man, right? <laughs> I, I guess and not. it's raining. Oh, that thanks for honking and seeing if we're okay. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> Why don't you tell me a, a private eye story since we got a little bit of time to kill, huh? Yeah, sure, why not? Uh, let's see, uh... Ah, yes. One of, one of my all-time favorite cases was a jewelry store back in Liberty City. It was, uh, some guy was, uh, reporting to see, oh, no, my jewelers are stolen, so I spent an entire month trying to track down whoever took it. Ends up being the owner of the store. Was trying Classic. to... I know! I mean, you'd think you'd only read that in, like, books and stuff, but apparently not. Apparently actual people do that kind of thing and try to leave the country with their mistress. Classic. Absolutely classic. I feel like I'm watching an episode of... <laughs> do anything uh, like life threatening or anything like that? Anything like what? Life threatening? Oh, life threatening? Oh man. Um, not too much. I usually, I'm, I'm I'm one of the few that likes to stay out of danger, mostly because I actually don't do guns. So, if I do find myself in a situation like that, I really don't have a way to defend myself. Oh, absolutely. Sometimes when I do find myself in a situation like that, I try to... I, I try to talk my way out of it, you know what I mean? <laughs> I know what you mean, buddy. Okay. It's... it's raining. I... I... I wolf. What, 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 there were wolves out here? Yeah, there was something real sketchy about all that, to be honest with you. I, I felt like... James Clay might not actually be a good man. Well, I mean, it's kind of hard to tell, uh, seeing as how we only met him for a couple of seconds. But at the very least, yeah, he seems uh, a tiny bit underhanded. I mean, I don't mean to be uh, judging anyone, or anything, but like, they were wearing masks. <laughs> I was, yeah, I, I, I don't think I even remember what what who Millie is, cause uh, she wouldn't take off her mask. And, and we did meet James with a mask initially. And a crate. <laughs> and a crate. Can't get the crate. Nope. Alright, sorry Rivaldi, but we're going. Meet Caro is Sue Caro. That's my car is your car, right? That's right. Yeah, I speak Japanese. Nice! Wait. Whoa. Ah, it's actually down here. Oh, sweet lord. You sure you want to take your car down here, man? Well, I ain't walking down there. <laughs> oh, my, well, my phone's ringing. Oh, shit. Maybe it's... Maybe or, this. We're about to find out. Hello? Hello? Hello, hello? Anyone there? Hello? Uh, got a call, but I'm not hearing anybody. And... <laughs> and they hung up. I did, but I don't. Surely he's where we left him, right? 
Uh, which way was it? Um, um, go go right. No, no, he's there. There he is. Oh, hey, dude. Oh, jeez. <laughs> there he is. Sorry, you took we're a while. So we're you, like... man. Yeah. Oh, jeez, guys. I thought, I thought you fell down the cliff, man. And, yeah. And then. Oh. You okay, we're... bro? Yeah, I'm good, very good. Okay, settle the light. And then I woke up and you weren't there, and, and I ran out and I looked for you, man, and I'm trying to find you. They go again with the beeping. <laughs> yup. At least, at least they, they beeped. Sometimes they just go ahead and uh, try to ram you. Yeah. Oh, shit. I guess these are some of the trucks that he was talking about earlier. Yeah, maybe. So let's go or let's go not. Why, why are the lights on? Are, are, there, people, are there people in these trucks? Uh, maybe. There's a car back there in the bush. Oh yeah, you see. Be careful, man. Whoa, sorry, I forgot my car was mad powerful. It looks old, but it's ridiculously fast for no good reason. Yeah. yeah man. Well, is that That's the mine? mine? Man, and, and, and yes, check, this is a mine. I think so. Frank, do you mind if I get out real quick? Oh no, go for it. I was just gonna ask if we we're gonna go, if we we're gonna Scooby Do it up. I think we should investigate. Well, you heard the man. Log the car, Frank. Log the car. Do it what? You need, do you lock or no? Gun. Oh, you mean lock. a gun gun? A shoot gun? No, lock the car. Oh, lock the car! <laughs> yeah. I'm so yeah. sorry. I got you. I couldn't hear it through all that vodka. I'm, I'm sorry. Yeah, the last thing we need is to come back out and have my car be gone. Nice. I don't think so. It's, it's really gone. Oh my god, you can actually go inside of this thing. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Oh no. We can mine <laughs> here. In there. Well, we, we need to let James know whether or not we're going to initiate the whole mining thing, shouldn't we? I was just here to explore. I I, I know how to I know a little bit how to mine, you know. I can show. How can you see inside here? It's all dark. Hey guys, I think I'm starting to suffocate already. That Oh, oh god. This isn't a pickaxe, this is a jackhammer. <laughs> um, I, I, I don't think we should do this for too long, boys, and go sell just whatever we can carry and see how much money this thing is. M my thoughts exactly. What the fuck do you think you're doing? Oi, sorry, I think... Sorry, sorry, man. Sorry, man. Yeah, this guy's already got this spot. Okay, do you wanna die? God, what the crazy... Shit, down. sorry, man. Sorry. I thought that was a bag, my bad. Fellas? Fellas? It's dark in here, man. It's very dark. We should back away and let the nice man continue to do his things with his items, okay? Okay, I don't know why he's. Well, let me just tell you something, bro. I didn't no. do anything wrong. Okay, I'm not scared of you, bitch. Uh, come on, please, just leave the man be. Down, hands up and down now. Shut the fuck up. Oh God. Uh, oh, fuck. Um, yeah, right, You're still dude. a sucker, fool. Oh, what is uh, with that? Is not that is not a good. Just, just, play, just play cool. Your and, haircuts suck. Oh, God. Ow. Ow. Hey, can um can someone call an ambulance? I think I'm bleeding out. 
Well, yeah, see, that's the thing. Right now we're at gunpoint, and it might not be smart to do anything that the man with the hey, gun might not Hey, go mine your shit and leave us alone, you murdering oh, bastard. Well, I mean, you guys didn't leave him alone. You fucking tried to steal my crate, and then you fucking insult me for no reason. It was an accident, you problem? fool. Get the hell out of here. You, you shoot people? You shoot people? I'm dying, man. In my last words, I want to say fuck you. Oh, jeez. <sighs> Um, kind of people. Just ah. him already. Oh, oh you. Right, th thank you. Sorry about that. Okay. Okay. Look, uh, uh Caleb, we're gonna, we're gonna, I'm gonna see if I can uh, get you some help. What did we learn today? We need to go outside to look as the. I can see elves. That no. Uh, uh d d is there some way I could pick you up? Cause I don't think you can move. Uh, mom. mom. No, 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 you're not seeing anyone's mom. Stay with me here. Uh, Rivaldi, you, you, I don't suppose you have the strength and upper torso ability to, to, to lift him up or anything? No, you can uh, take him out to be out of people's way here. Hey, fuck you. Fuck Would you. you. Stop it. With the, stop. He shot me, man. I'm, I'm, I'm freaking dying, man. I, I know. No, look, I know, I know, but r right now, we're not in a position to, uh, to, to, you know, uh, uh, make people angry that have, obviously have a means to shoot us, right? Frank, you look, you look good from this angle, man. I did. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. With right? speed, man. But no, 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 no. Right now, I'm looking at my little field manual, trying to figure out how, how best to proceed with the situation. Where's speed, man? I want to say oh. bad speed, man. Yeah. Well, I think he actually ran out. Speed! Nah, I believe in speed. It's so bright. It's so bright, man. Okay, okay, right. New plan, new plan. Get up, you, you don't die, please. It's so bright. Oh, Jesus. Uncle Willie? Oh no! Is that you, Uncle Willie? <laughs> I haven't it's seen you in years. David says, "Kill him, it's David says." Okay. Please, uh, all right. Okay. Uh, here's the deal. Uh, I'm gonna call an ambulance. With any luck, uh, I'm gonna be able to uh, uh, d d get someone here for help. Hey. Uh... Oh, uh, no, hey. not Robert. That one guy shoot my. Yeah, he, sh no, he stole. He stole thirty thousand from me, man. Caleb, no, no one stole anything. There was a misunderstanding, and unfortunately, the my elves, friend here got the shot. Elves, they shot me. Police, the police, elves shot me. Please, we need medic. My, my um, friend is dying. Police, my friend is dying. Hi. Oh Jesus. Hey, man. Right Help me, man. Right now. Right now. Oh. Uh, okay. Help me, man. I'm freaking <laughs> dying, guy, man. This guy called the police. One guy, one guy shoot my friend. Please help him. He's dying. I think, I think you hands should just, you. you should put up your hands is what you should do right now, Rivaldi. Put your hands up right now. Just do what they say. Put your hands up right now. I believe. Uh, this, is uh, a, this is a fine mess. Hey. Frank, I'm sorry, man. Oh, it's okay. Just, you know, if, if we make it through this, remember not to insult yeah, someone's haircut hand. next time. Why is the ambulance pointing guns at us, man? It's not an ambulance. Those are people. Now, all of you, this is what you're going to do. You are is going this to not the police, this man? Right here. Oh, quiet, sir. Go ahead. All three of you, put your face up against the okay. rock here now. All three of you. Come on, get going. We'll deal with that in a minute, sir. Go ahead and comply with the orders given to you. Do it now. Up against the wall. Up against the wall. Other wall. You can, you can ask this <sighs> lame down guy. He's okay, going to shot by Robert. Um, okay, he you can stop talking. Don't for talking. It's Don't getting talk. brighter, man. It's getting brighter, man. It's getting real bright. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and let me. Hey, uh, Jordan, can you get to be a last bag and treat the patient right there? 
All right, both of you, or all three of you, currently you guys are under, uh, you guys are currently detained. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you. You have the right to a government appointed attorney during a legal questioning. Do all of you understand your right to remain Yes, officer. Yes, officer. Okay, I'm going to begin with you right here. You phone 911. What's your name? Where is your wallet? Uh, 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 hey, hey, Speed. Okay, hey, I can Speed, how'd you get so fast? Uh, Alright. Oh, Sass, this guy is the caller. The name he said is the one that matches the caller ID of the phone message. So I'm gonna go ahead and believe them for the time being. Alright, so compare. Are you right here? Turn around. Go ahead and put your hands down. I can believe you can call 911. Uh, All right, uh, now to tell me what do the robbers look like? What vehicle were they driving? How many of them were? As of now, you're just being detained. You're not being. You're not under arrest right now. You're just being detained, right? Yes, sir. Thank you. I'm gonna check out the tunnel a little further. Okay, break. okay, that's right. We are free to get robbed. Okay, you three got robbed. Yes. Okay, now tell me. Uh, actually, I'd prefer to hear it from him. Um, you uh, right here. Uh, how yes, many sir. men? Was it one man? Black shirt, white mule. Was that about right? Is that the guy? What type of gun did he? Have? Well, um, uh, it, it was just one gentleman. Uh, uh, okay. It. I think he was wearing dark, but then again, they were in a cave. It was hard to see, but he, he just used a pistol. Okay. You really know. Was he mining here? Did he take anything from you? Oh yeah, he he was he was mining. Uh, there was a misunderstanding between okay. my friends here. Uh, I I believe uh, uh, one of us kind of got in his way by accident, but I I, so... I think bravado took place and they kind of puffed chess hairs and one thing led to another. One of them had a gun, uh, okay. we didn't. So, you're telling me it wasn't a robbery. Instead, it was a heat of the moment and he shot your friend. Uh, yes, that's what I'm telling you, yes. Uh, okay. Also, why'd you say something about let's not insult each other's haircut anymore? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, sir. It, it, it was, it, it's the silliest thing. Uh, my friend there was in, insulting the other guy who who had evidently shot him, uh, was insulting his haircut. And I was trying to tell him, hey, calm down, dude. He has a gun. Let's just walk away. But he just wouldn't back off. Okay, alrighty. Did your friend instigate it? Did he hit him? Did he do anything like that? Initially, no. He did not instigate, but uh, when, when we accidentally got in his face, instead of, you know, apologizing and walking away, he was just like, Hey, well, so-and-so, what are you, you know, uh, what are you doing and insulting him and all that? And, well, I mean, at that point, yeah. Okay, did your friend hit him at all? No, no, no blows were, as far as I could tell, no blows were done except for the firing of the gun. That's it. Okay, now this is what I'm going to have you do. I'm going to have all of you follow me, please. I'm going to go ahead and carry your bag. So go ahead and follow me. Alright, now all of you, single file line in front of me. Single file. If you are handcuffed, be single file in front of me. There we go. The guy in black uh, doesn't need to, does he? Oh, he doesn't need to. Um, I'm going to go ahead and say this. I don't think any of them did the crime. It didn't look like any of them were armed. And it seems like it wasn't a robbery. It was more like uh, one person pissed off the other. The other had a gun and shot. So it's looking like a spur-of-the-moment murder. Okay, That's what it's looking ahead. like to me. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and leave to their bag. It just seems like a spur-of-the-moment type murder. We'll see if we can spot the vehicle, but other than that... I don't have any reason for committing any type of crime when they were... Thank oh. you, officers, very much. Well, okay. Let's yes, just so next time... Over to pair of this oh, yes, sir. You guys can go ahead and return your business. I've got all the facts I need from this case. Just, uh, if he comes by again, go ahead and phone 911 and we'll come by. For the time okay. being, we'll Thank look you. out for a white man. Okay. Thanks, officer. Sorry about that. Alright, you guys uh, have a great right, day. No problem. Well, great. See you around. Have a good day, officers. 
Uh, Harry Rivaldi. I think it'd be nice. I think it's suffice to say I'm done with mining for the, the while. Yeah, same thing. If it's okay with you, if you need to go someplace, let me know. Otherwise, I'm just going to go ahead and uh, do my ride along with the EMS like I should have done. Yeah, we can go. Okay. We can go to the car lab, you know? The hospital or something like that. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I got to go there anyway. Uh, did you want to go there with me? Yeah, sure. All right, let's go. Let's go. And, and let's try to have this as a learning experience, shall we? And that was the mining incident. A friend got shot, humility was purposely avoided, and I had a newfound fear of mine shafts. It's amazing how much can happen in a single day. I went on to participate in various ride-alongs with the local Los Santos Emergency Services. Little did I know that I had unwittingly begun the journey of becoming an EMT myself, uh, but that's another story. Until next time, stay safe out there, Los Santos.